So this is um, a national project to try to improve the recognition of babies that are in trouble because they're not growing as well as they should in the womb. And uh, we have uh, rolled out a program which is called GAP, the Growth Assessment Protocol, which improves um, the recognition of babies that are uh, uh, in trouble. And so they then can be recognized and managed in a way that uh, they can be delivered earlier and safer. And that has shown to be able to reduce um, adverse outcomes and in particular stillbirths and uh, stillbirths have reduced as a result of it year on year in the National Health Service. So it's really important. We are not for profit organization, the Perinatal Institute, um, but we're supporting uh, the front end clinicians, that's uh, midwives, doctors, ultrasonographers, and sometimes they're working in uh, quite a bit of um, shortage of resources and uh, we are able to sort of fill in there make sure that the training is there, we're giving them tools for better uh, surveillance. And so there is a real partnership there where a lot of front-end clinicians are appreciating the support that they're getting and they're able to provide the care that they want to for the, uh, for the mothers and babies. Well, I'm lucky to have such a team that is so dedicated to this and obviously this uh, helps us to sort of carry on with the work and uh, make sure that the whole of the country and all uh, units are uh, uh, involved. Already 80% of the NHS is uh, in the program, um, but um, that sort of encouragement is, is important because there are lots of competing priorities and there's often lots of shortages of staffing, skills, resources, and we are always uh, up against that. This is a very important area for mothers and babies and we need to keep a focus on it. This award will help us to do that.